I definitely miss, I mean, obviously I miss just all you guys and all, like, the energy too, and shooting pranks and the comedy of it and doing that. I think it was like having to do it every yeah. single day. weekend here so we're going to see Nino. Oh that's nice. Say hi to him. Yeah yeah. Anything yeah. you think we should ask him? No we'll keep that off the record. <laughs> <laughs> hey Nino. No <laughs> questions you want to know from him? Yeah, maybe not on camera, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, I guess again. I'll be back tomorrow. Okay. See you nice later. To see you guys. Good to see you. Alright so we just left uh, my old house. I was uh, staying at my dad's house for a few days. We're back in Meadowvale, Mississauga. Pretty much yeah where it all started man. This is our local Tim Hortons. We're gonna get a little coffee. Like I said, I hit up um, Nino, shot him a message. Nino literally lives like 30 seconds from this Tim Hortons. He said he's headed to the gym. I said I'm about to stop by Tim's for a coffee. If you wanna come by Tim's, he's down, so. Yeah, you guys obviously know some shit went down with Nino, but I'm not condoning anything or agreeing with anything, whatever, but whatever happened with us and Nino was like a long time ago, so. Even if I didn't do this on camera, I, I would see him probably off camera. So I know you guys would want to see this too because we were all kind of like on a journey together. So I think it's cool to just, just catch up and you guys could see Nino. Good. Uh, he's, he's got to pat you. Got to oh, pat you down. New measures. We're going here. I just got my keys. I'm just fine. I'm just kidding. Bro. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. Just kidding. yeah okay. but right, hey, you, know, you never no, no. know. In Toronto, it's it's crazy out there. It's good just, the good. Oz God. Uh -oh. oh, someone's trying to park. Oh uh, shit! Put it in. Yeah, yeah. Actually, we we saw each other at the gym. I saw Nano twice at the gym this week. Yeah, just yeah, by yeah. coincidence, right? Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. All coincidence. I go to a gym for about two years now. Yeah. Oh. You locked up? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're locked up. Yeah, man. So you have a girl. Yeah, yeah. How long? Uh, just over eight months now. Okay. You gotta live the dream, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm chilling though, I'm good. That's good. You're getting close to the anniversary. Yeah, yeah, in about a week. Actually, two weeks. Two weeks. Wait, you said eight months. Yeah, yeah, but going to nine. Oh, yeah. Don't be that guy that celebrates every month, you know? No. Nah. month anniversary guy? Ah. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that is Nino for sure. Yeah? You got security? You never know what it is like in Toronto. He looks like Andrew Tate with the beard, right? Don't fuck with him though, he's like serious. No, 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 no. It, it's, it's a compliment. No, 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 he's like. He's like kind of hard. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Just kidding. What's that? Well, don't film me. Oh, oh no, 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 no. And... I thought you were doing sign language. Oh, yeah, because my sister's deaf, so I thought. Okay. Do you know sign language? Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry about that. Um... <laughs> Get banned from our local yeah. Tim's. Man, would be so pissed that. Eh? Long story short, they changed their copy, and now McDonald's took what Tim Hortons has. So Not McDonald's. That, that's cat, no? Have you tasted it? <laughs> Double actually, doubles are fire. But... Actually, no, I take my coffee black. Like your women? No. You like your women black with a little bit of cream, no? No, no. I like white women. Okay, lots of cream. <laughs> <laughs> did you ever talk to Jesse or no? Well, I didn't talk to him, but I, he, he did follow me like a couple months ago. Oh, he followed you back? Yeah. Did you guys both unfollow each other? Yeah, for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> no, no disrespect, it's just, you know, but you know what though, that was four years ago, so like, you know, what was four years? like just talk to him and all that, you know. Yeah. You but, guys always had a little, ah, off camera, it was off camera stuff, you know. It was once on camera, remember the boxing? Oh yeah, yeah, but you know what though, that was like half and half. What do you miss most about now, if anything? The traveling, to be honest. You love traveling. Yeah, yeah. Some people, I mean, some people didn't like to travel, I just love to drive. And then the, the driving, the driving was probably the funnest. Except when Jesse got on Oz. <laughs> what was your favorite now for the moment? I think it was Arizona State. Like those those times were probably the best. But Europe for sure. <laughs> Germany was a vibe. Barcelona was a vibe. You were a fucking brothel addict. Yeah, but you know what? Time's changed though. Time's <laughs> no, changed. Yeah. 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 The past I mean, makes you who you are today, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you still drink, party. I've been off that for about four years almost. You're always kind of a half anyway. You never really. Yeah, I think what it is, you know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, Nano is dope because he always DD too. You know what? Though? You were never like a big like. You didn't really like drink, drink anything. No, You'd I mean. You have like two, three grownest nights. Are you making like a living? Steadily, you know. Not been easy, especially with COVID. It was. I use COVID as an excuse though. COVID's okay. over. COVID's over. No, no, no. I was saying in 2021, like that. 2020, like legit. As soon as I started my business, two months later, it just the world shut down. What do you want to do? Like, what do you want to achieve? 
I want to just be more of like a cinematographer a bit. Like just want to like get into the more like direct, like creating videos, little docs. I, I like doing the doc style. You are good being on camera too, but you don't like it. If I'm just being myself, like right, like what we are right now, like I'm more comfortable just like talking about shit. I like podcasts too, like. You should start a pod with some people in Toronto. Yeah, I was thinking about that, like. I watch that. I mean, we always watch Nino's pods. I saw when you're like, I'm done with homecomings. I am retiring from homecomings. <laughs> you would never see me at a homecoming street party. No, I am retired. I know. Yeah. Well, we're 29, bro. Hopefully, yeah. yeah. You, should, oh, yeah. <laughs> you shouldn't have to say that out loud, bro. Nah. <laughs> you were hilarious in the videos. Like, even when we weren't trolling you, like, yeah. Nino's jokes, like, okay, yeah, let's roll. Yeah, yeah, And no then worries. come watch the fight with us tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a good day. See you, Nino. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're at the St. Regis in Toronto. Oh, it's good. Good. That's good. Uh, last night. Had some dirties in the booth. Boys are getting active. Did anyone say anything to you about that prank here? So many, bro. Yo, it's an open banana guy. Not what you want to be known for, you know. Put that in your IG bio. Toss that on LinkedIn, eh? It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Ooh, it's sexy good. fucking butt. Holy, it's got yeah. that on like, carrot oh. eh? <laughs> You look like one of those white guys Drake posts. It's that's like tough right there. Yo, that's true. <laughs> that's that's, that's yeah. the sauce you have, bro. Yeah, yeah, that's dope. Does anyone know what Carabana actually is or not? No idea. Oh, yeah. We're going to this thing called Carabana. It's like some Caribbean festival Toronto is like really famous for. But I don't know much about it, but it goes on every fucking year at Toronto. We'll probably run into a lot of characters. Uh, what up, Mike? It's good, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. It's good. I've never heard of this. Holy, this guy fucked. I'm excited for today, man. We got... Okay, my, my dad. I brought up the fresh whites for your voice. I brought up the fresh whites. Don't, whites. don't make me do it, man. What size is that? It does not come in men's. It does not come in men's. <laughs> Small going. Huh? Holy you picked fun. it out for me. She's my stylist. Yeah, I was. <laughs> I'm trying to catch a booty today. Oh, that's catch. easy. There'll be lots of bubbles to catch. Chappy said he wants to get his black belt this trip, so let's see if we can make it happen. Well, this is gonna be your element too. Uh, maybe. Oh. You put on his best fit too. If a blacker wants to experience like the other side for like just to see how it is and then never go back again. He's be like true. the perfect guy be to true. do it, right? Just gotta fill his beers. Caravana. No, honestly, black women do not fuck with me and I will show you why. Like, if you're a nerd and you're black, it's not gonna work. Like, I'm gonna try to spit game at a black girl, I promise you it won't work. Why? To the white community, I'm like saucy, but like to the black community, I suck. No, I did. How you doing? You think I'm cute? No, sir, I don't. Uh, see, what did I just say? They don't fuck with me. I don't know if it's a Toronto thing, but like, they want me like this, they want me like this. If I walk like this, I'll pull. You gotta sag like all the way let's though. Let's see, like. let's see, watch. Watch the sag, look at the sag. Look, now watch this. He's gonna go to jail. <laughs> Shout out now, bro! Now set your bags, 2023! Shout out now, bro! Jamaicans are dope. Bro, the energy here is great. I wish you guys could hear us, bro. Fuck. Here. Uh, you ready to bubble? Uh uh, I'm not bubbling. You say I gotta teach you. No, you teach me. I don't wanna be on YouTube now. No, you too. You married? Yes, I am. No, this is for our documentary. It is That's a hard bubble to pop yeah, right there. Another one. Get on there, dog. Get on there. Yeah, handle that. Get on it. I can't dance. I'm fucking useless on the dance floor. That's why I hate Bad Bunny, but I'm kind of fired up now. It's like when you're playing golf and you like hit the range. Now you're warmed up, so I'm ready. People are gasping me up about this bubble I got. Join me my new day, bro. Cuando vivo solo sueño un horizonte falto de palabras. Sombra y en tres luces todo es negro para mi mirada. Si tú no estás junto a mí aquí.
trajeto eres tú Contigo viviré por ti Listen, boys, some things have been said online, but I say all together, we do one more homecoming. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. I'll only do it if it's with them. What? How am I gonna get canceled? I already been canceled once enough. <laughs> You gotta talk louder. It's kind of loud in here. What? Got here, guys. Right? Meet you. Finally. So, funny story. I actually saw your podcast with Anthony and Vanessa on the Money Wise Happiness. I see. Really? Yeah. That's how you're. If you're here, you're gonna film. You're not gonna riz. No, no, no. I... No rizzing policy. If you're staying, you gotta get on the camera. Okay. We were just saying hi. It's kind of loud in here. It's a loud luxury, but they're from uh, Toronto area. They're big DJs. They're performing at Veld tonight. It's like a huge EDM festival. Jada, quick question for you. What is the chances your boss will let you off early? We got an extra ticket to Veld. We've seen if you want to come. Considering that is really closing today, I love to, but... No shot? <laughs> well, we have nine holes. Go ask. Nine we have an extra holes. ticket. We're going to see Loud Luxury. It'd be awesome if you'd come. I would love so much. I'll ask. All right, okay. When we're back, we'll find out. Thanks. I don't know if that's a strikeout, though. I don't know. That's a maybe. No, she said maybe. So, yeah, rejected. That's a hard Probably. reject. All right, boys. A little rainy golf. Are we going to go to Vell dressed in our golf shit? You're not even in golf shit. Just to come you might out. have to buy golf shit. I'm going to buy golf. <laughs> <laughs> Buys it just to wear it to Vell. <laughs> People are gonna be so confused. Sorry, We're gonna look eyes. so sad. So <laughs> this is oh my god. <laughs> Bring the Rubik's. So yeah, last time we came here, we were at Veld. We did the spin the globe challenge, if you guys remember that. Me, Jesse, and Nino. Now we're back, like what, four or five years later? What's the plan? So, yes. he's got one job and one button. That's it. Yeah. And one finger, technically, too. Yeah. So mix the three together, and and this is no, this is numbers wise, like your guys' biggest track, right? Body. By it far. has a billion streams. Yes. Yes. Went platinum in a bunch of countries, yeah. and you're gonna press play on it tonight. Yeah. So if, if we fuck this one up, it's <laughs> just make sure you don't press it at a different time, because then we'll stop the song. Oh, okay. Are you ready? Yeah, so wait, 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 button wait, wait, right here. Ready? That's what it looks like. Okay, you ready? That one actually says play. The space bar. Exactly. Yeah. That's what we need. That? Just yeah. once. No, just oh, once. Oh, oh. If you press it twice, <laughs> it's gonna stop. <laughs> We're fucked. So, uh, I was born for this shit. Come so, on. Uh, <laughs> cheers, boys. Cheers. cheers.
called full set. That's what you call the all organic 100% free zap! Hey, out of here. Come on. Age losing weight, all the boys are getting dialed. Right, let's go, you know? Yo, ladies, it's dial season, eh? Dial season. Yeah, like the boys are absolutely clocking in for a big shift. You heard it here first, we're all getting dialed. I just started a big gym grind. Gabe's taking a diabetes shot that's probably gonna give him cancer in 30 years, but we're all losing weight. Yeah. Yeah, I'm out at Brooklyn. Now I'm down in Tribeca, right next to the narrow. But I'll be hood forever. All right, boys. Day one, New York. Steiny's back from his gay couple's Barcelona trip with Gabe. <laughs> it wasn't gay at all, How honestly. He posted a photo of you guys kissing on the okay, cheek. Uh, I didn't know last minute he was gonna do a he did a face turn right before she clicked the picture, which was I was not okay with that, by the way. And that's See, not guys, gonna be seen anywhere. You guys did it. It was already on the internet. Yeah, I know. Now you're gonna pop it up in the video. But yeah, nothing happened. I mean, he posted a photo of you guys kissing on the cheek. I don't know what to say. Like, I'm not. Am I being rude? <laughs> I had a bad Spanish chick there. I brought Gabe because he handles all the shit. Can speak fucking four languages. So I bring him as like an assistant. I got a question for Dylan Nanas, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Do you actually think you can beat up Islam? I like, kill Islam. I think he doesn't make it past two rounds. 100%. I think you're out of his mind. I bet you I submit him. I, how much you want to bet? We ever fight 50k, I submit him. Oh. I'd, I'd bet you so much money. 50k? I submit him. I'm sorry, Islam would fuck you up. I just made a bet. Islam would fuck you up. No, no, this is all respect. Don't kill me. <laughs> no, would you? Are you out of your mind? Bro, ask Kyle right now. I bet he'd say, I kick his ass. No, you wouldn't say that. He wouldn't say that. If you think Islam, Yo, we've been 50k. You. Who wins? Me or Islam? Me or Islam? Yes, he would. He's killing you. I'm not in No, that's my stuff, bro. We've been 50k. Bro, today we talked about I was killed Joe Jones, too. You're out of your mind. Fuck, you're you're out of your yeah, mind. we should have had him on the podcast. I want to be good. I, I think you're out of your goddamn mind. I always kill him. I don't think you would. So, yeah, you, you don't think Islam took me down? I was the middle? He, he'd follow you, in my opinion. Give me Khabib, come on. Oh, you've got to be out of your mind. Nah, nah, get out of my cell. You don't know how to make, bro. We all want to keep fighting. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to see Dylan in the ring. Oh, yo, I mean, we don't want to let go, so hold tight. Oh, like, there's someone's out letting go, right? Look. You're good. You're good. Yeah. I'm done, I'm done. See, that's good, right? <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Shit! This fucking yeah, almost broke my thumb! <laughs> yo, yo. You in the room? Yeah. You almost there? We're 15 away. Look, I'm still 35 minutes oh, away. Oh shit, we're good. It looks like a big crowd though, right? Yeah, yeah, there is. It looks organized, but it looks like big. Fucking traffic, man. It's brutal here. Looks like a good crowd. Really good. Really good crowd. Yeah, 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 let's good. pull up and get help. Yeah. yeah. You wanna go on to the front? Uh -huh. Go through the front. Fuck it. Coming up, I was confused. My mommy kissing a girl. Confusion occurs coming up in the cold world. Daddy ain't around, probably out committing felonies. My favorite rapper used to sing, check, check out my melody. I wanna live. Who else is shit? I sell dope for a full thing to ring. One of them go ropes. Nanny told me if I pass, I get a sheep skin coat. If I can move a few packs, I get the hat. Now that'd be dope. Watch all your videos all the time. You're your happy dad all the time, man. We love you guys. Thanks for coming, man. Been watching now. Been watching. What's your favorite thing about Dana White? He's never changed, the most solid dude ever. Trump backup, no filter, don't ever change. Me and Dana talk though, we might be supporting Biden next election. Trump 2024, RFK is running me, fucking up the DNC. Alright boys, UFC fight night. Sugar Sean, we're pulling up to the fight right now. I might be wheeling Corinna honestly tonight. Are you guys ready your first fight night? Well, I'm hoping Sean wins. You flew in just for this? Uh, honestly, yeah, I flew from Nashville here. So we're here, we're ready. I don't like violence, so I'm kind of nervous. Do you watch on TV or no? Sometimes, but it's like, I don't want to like, I don't want anyone to get hurt. You know, like seriously hurt. I probably sound like a freaking idiot. I've never been back here before. I came specifically for you, Kyle. I only came for Kyle because he invited me. Oh wow. So like, I can't say no, I'll never be invited to anything ever again. He's asking me to take her on dates like a few times. Is this true? I think that's like a dream of his or something, but no. Gambles! This guy needs a zap. Bring him back to life. You need a zap? Bring him back. Yeah, yeah. Woo! <laughs> Wait, right there, Ozzy. No. 40. 
so the credentials oh, get to punch his head. head. <laughs> they want to punch the crowd? No, I'm just saying. If you want to text Dana and say, who gave this guy a badge? Alright. I'm okay sitting back there and let you walk over. Okay, so wait right here. We could have walked up here. Do you know how much he loves that badge? You get a shot of it or no? Touch my badge. You can don't touch me either. Bro, we can film it. No, we cannot. Buddy, I will ban That's you from the power. UFC. Don't forget. We're gonna do it again. They're gonna let you film. Too much power. Don't forget who organizes. How many fans, 19 year old fans, are gonna see that tonight? You know he's flexing this on guys. Every guy at the bar is seeing that. How long is the dry street been? How dry are you right now? New York, I struck out. Toronto, I struck. Fuck, it's been two weekends. <laughs> two weekends. Holy fuck. I, That's I, I bad can't. For me. That's bad for me. Slatty has a girlfriend, so he's getting steady pumps. <laughs> We're gonna pull up on Jesse now. We met up last night, we had dinner, but we didn't film or anything like that. But we were talking yesterday and we said uh, we're gonna come see his crib and stuff. Yeah. We didn't want to film anything last night because we were just like kind of catching up. Yeah, yeah, it was good just to talk. Give us a tour. MTV crib. Oh, oh shit. shit. Here we go. No kidding. Go TV first. Here we go. Chewy! I know, I see you. Thanks. You would have so a fucking cool. treadmill right in your living room, man. Eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I need the TV, man. There's a lot of shit in this room. Yeah, that offer one through this morning. It's funny about my house. So oh, nice. Dope, man. Are you getting a house? Yeah. Like, right. Literally just last night. What's this is a relaxing yeah. spot. That's like counting cows. Count calories. And I kind of made this rule of like five things I'm trying to do every single day. The fucking miles and all that shit. Dude, cardio must be so hard. Bro, I ran in Australia. I just, I was, I called an Uber. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I to the gym. I was like, bro, I'm exhausted right now. I swear to God. You kept the Nike app on it? No, I not. <laughs> bro, the first time I ran, like I ran like six months ago, the first mile ever, and I fucking threw up. I wore a sauna suit to the beach. And I, thought I, could, I thought I was fucking like David Goggins or something. Yeah, how long have you been sober for? Like, I think almost three years. Oh my gosh. Wow. I definitely miss fucking just like having a glass of wine or fucking so a beer, bad. like in the sun or something. Mm -hmm. like that. So you don't drink like at all, like ever? No. Mm -hmm. You listen to David Gargans when you run? I've done it once. To be honest with you, he's so calm right now. Chewy? Yes. I know. I'm actually surprised. But he's so fat. You're <laughs> so funny. You just call him fat? I'm <laughs> 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 fat too. Though. Abe loses ten pounds and starts calling people fat. Eh? <laughs> I mean, he's not that fat. I know. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't right. see him. So think I, didn't, I didn't think he was fat. <laughs> how how was it like? After you stopped doing the videos, did you ever miss it or like just anything about it? Yeah, no, hundred percent. I definitely miss. I mean, obviously, I miss just all you guys and all like the energy too, and shooting pranks and the comedy of it and doing that. I think it was like having to do it every yeah, single day. Sure. But then when you don't have to do it, you like miss the like this thing you loved fucking doing for sure. It's it is like, crazy. We were saying yesterday, like just looking back on it. I think every era is like funny and then it's just like different. Like mm -hmm. even the old shit is like hilarious. When we go to LA, it's like a bit different, but it's still funny. 
and then like Europe is like different but funny and then when you guys join it's the same shit it's, it's like, like it's kind of just like, different I, though I, I, people comment that like I miss the old milk and it's like you can't replace that shit right like you can't recreate that shit literally the meeting I was having before I came here I was talking to this guy about it and he was like he was talking about milk and we were talking about how like that grind of having to do something to like make it like, you know what I'm talking about like the fucking Bro, we're just like, I'm gonna go work at DeFasco with my fucking dad, and yeah, you know I mean, like, we're just like, if this doesn't work, like, what are we yeah. gonna do? And that drive to fucking, like, just make it is, like, where the magic happens, kind of, as hard as that sounds. But, like, that's where it's, like, you have to do it to make it, like, you're not scared of getting arrested, you're not scared of fucking overworking yourself, you have no relationships, you're fucking, like, you're just dialed. It's crazy. But you're keeping the train going. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's still going. It's just content and just pretty much happy dad. Happy dad's, like, kind of what we always just wanted to do, right? Yeah. I think people also think too, you know, it's like all about the money or like, you know what I mean? But like, they don't get how much satisfaction we get out of like making funny shit. When you guys shoot something, you know, it's like, oh, oh, this is the best feeling ever. But even, let's say not just like, cause like people are gonna respond and like it, it's like this thing's gonna hit. You guys figured out like the science of this fucking smashing and then it does and it's like. And then we generally really like it. <laughs> I think we all come from like a, natural like entertainer you want to think of something make it and like entertain people and have them give you good feedback right yeah, yeah. Well, that's, that's the best feeling yeah it's so peaceful you like it here no i mean at the it's house it's a little hot but <laughs> <laughs> you got a fan in here <laughs> <laughs> no, is there air conditioning no is there actually no air conditioning <laughs> <laughs> <It's natural laughs> <style. laughs> yeah, i think we were talking yesterday too but for if there's ever like ideas <laughs> that there's ever yeah. we all want to do together we could just treat it like a more collaborative thing you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It'd be cool if we were thinking to uh, let us know what you guys think in the comments. We were talking last night. We we're saying, what if we just got everyone back together and just did like a trip? That'd be dope. There'd what be is? some old Nelk members, new Nelk members too. Uh -huh. It'd be good. Maybe if you Bradley all... would come. Andrew yeah. Schultz. Makes it all the personality. It's gonna be funny, man. Good. Yeah, because I was never really there when Nino was there, so it would just be funny if oh, like, yeah. just hanging out. <laughs> it it would have been so funny to see how Nino would have reacted. Like, I think at the beginning when you joined, he would have fucking hated you. Yeah, I was annoying. Because so. Nino was very protective as well of, of newcomers. It's kind of like, you know, any, any, any newcomers that would come around and they'd fuck around, Nino would like, he'd fucking, he would hate it. There's nothing more that Nino loved than the brand. Nothing. Besides one thing, Snapchat. But that's it. But besides that, he loved the brand. He had a snap deal? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Did he have a snap deal? You're ridiculous. Let us know what you guys think. Drop a thumbs up. We're gonna go on a little recruiting. Started with Jesse. We talked last night. He, he's in. We'll talk to Nino. You guys know Steve can't be on YouTube, which sucks. So we gotta figure something out like that, because we need Steve there. Yeah. He has to definitely. be there. So maybe we'll do an alternative version on like Twitter with Steve in it too. Would your dad go? Yeah. My dad's like waiting. The guy yeah. took off his full sun shirt. Yeah. Man. He's like, yeah, yeah. his full sun shirt every day. Let us know if you guys have any ideas. I think a trip would be cool. Maybe we'll do we'll do some pranks too. But I think we just go on a trip and just vibe, I'm just down. have fun, yeah. not do some forced like Jersey Shore reunion type episode. You know what I mean? Where it's like, let's go have fun. Yeah, yeah, just go have fun. Yeah. Just have what is that? Have uh, fun in Utah. Good to see you, buddy. Uh, all right, my man. I'll text you about the uh, abs and everything. Yeah, yeah. Good. Love you guys. I'll see you later. <laughs> Alright guys, I thought that was a really cool video. I hope you guys liked it. Um, it's really good seeing Jesse and obviously seeing Nino and stuff like that. I'm sure that was fucking cool for you guys too to see. I just wanted to kind of talk to you guys here at the end of the video because like, dude, it's just been such a crazy fucking like life changing journey. This whole thing is just a fucking blur, man. Like, we probably started taking Nelk seriously like I don't know, eight or nine years ago, like doing this shit full time, like it's almost been a fucking decade. When I go to these meetups, I see merch that we sold like nine years ago. And it's it's literally like, it's fucking baffling. Like I don't even, I don't even know what happened. I don't know how this all happened. Like we always had a feeling, we worked our asses off, we grinded, but let's just, now that I'm here, like people ask me all the time, it's like, I don't know, like it's just so fucking crazy. I'm so grateful, seriously. Every fucking day I'm so grateful for what we have, what we've built, for all you guys that support us, like everyone watching right now. Like there's probably a lot of OGs checking back in. Like seriously, we fucking love you guys and I'm so fucking thankful for anyone that's a fan of Nelk. You know, Jesse was obviously a big part of Nelk too and Nelk's obviously not the same without him. It's not the same without Nino. 
it's not the same without Steve, but it kind of just like, there's just been so many different chapters to this. And like, I know you guys, I see the comments too. Like I miss the old Nelk or the OG shit was better. Like, dude, I go back all the time and watch OG Nelk. And you guys are right, it's fucking hilarious. And then I'll go watch Europe era of Nelk. And like, that shit's fucking hilarious too. Like, it's just, every chapter's different and you can never recreate what that is. We just wanna upload videos and fucking have fun and entertain you guys with videos. That's seriously all I wanna do on this fucking channel. This whole OG vibe, it just kinda of fucking gave me a little jolt. I'm personally still motivated. I wanna get Nelk to 10 million subscribers. So I think we start that right now, Nelk to 10 million. Just don't take these videos too seriously. We're fucking, we're having fun and that's pretty much it. But yeah, I'm very, very, very grateful. You guys changed our fucking lives. Uh, all of us, mine, Steve's, Jesse's. Nino's needs a bit of work still, but we'll, we'll help him out with that a little bit. But yeah, love you guys. We will see you soon with a new video. Nelk to 10 million, let's start it right now. Nelk to fucking 10 mil. Wow, Happy, that was amazing. I thought the whole no more skinny cam bullshit was just a saying. I guess not. Honey, I'm home. Quick, Happy, hi. Hey, babe. Hi, honey. Uh, how's work? It was good. Why are you still in bed? I'm just reading. With a happy dad? I mean, it's Friday, right? Yeah, you're right. Thank God, honestly. We still doing dinner later? Uh-huh. Okay, good, I'm starving. Babe, where'd you get this pallet of happy dad? These aren't even bad. 100 calories, two grams of carbs? It's almost like cheating. I can see why you like these. I got big bucks, more than a G on us. Usually I'm modest, right now I'm being honest. Hoes is the only reason that I went to college. She a freak in the sheets. I might throw some D's on it.